Hello everybody and welcome to this video. Today I want to show you a little trick that I found out about Workers and Resources Soviet Republic. Um, there is a way to add resources to the map and um, also there's a way to see where the resources are actually because there's nothing that the game um, shows you like a resource map or something like that so you are basically on your own to find out where the resources are so you can go to for example construction and if you want to look for oil um, you simply choose the oil rig and move over the map to find out where the resources are and for example here we have oil in this area but it's uh, it's not the smallest area I've seen um, having oil but it's not very large so uh, in most of the other areas as you can see there is red dots underneath my mouse pointer so there's no oil at all however I found out how to add oil to the map and how to add other resources as well but I want to show you with the example of oil how to add this to the map it even works with already started um, games so you can simply like edit your save games and add oil to your already existing save games so basically one requirement or two we have actually two requirements it's um, just a graphic editor like GIMP for example it's free to have there's no cost at all and you need a plug-in for GIMP in order to be able to open DDS files the direct draw surface textures that um, are simply well they are the kind of the base of the map well let's talk I just want to show you how it works okay as you can see there's no oil here um, I will just save the game and let's say we call this I don't know oil okay so the game has been saved all right so now we go back to the main menu um let's just quit the game for a second here and start GIMP it's the German version I am German so <laughs> but I guess you will get the idea I will put the link to the um, DDS plugin in um, the video description so you can simply download it so will I do the same with um, the setup for the GIMP graphic editor. Okay, so now we open up just a file. I already installed um, the plugin, so I'll have no problem with that. Okay, so you go to your Steam folder, mine is on drive H, Steam, and there is um, a, co a folder called Steam Apps, come in, and then you will find Soviet Republic, and in the folder Media Soviet, save you will find your save games so I will have my oil save game here as well and if you open it and you have all pictures that um, GIMP is able to handle uh, in that list and there is a resource map .dds. and when we open up the file this is what the resources look like on the map so um, basically red is for oil blue is coal and green is iron so I said I just want to add some oil to the map I will just show you a very very simple example um, no what we do first is we grab the um, this tool right here so we can actually grab a color this red and then we will just paint all this color over the whole map uh, let's just make it real large so I won't have any problem with that okay let's just paint all over the map and this will make the map full of oil all right so I'll just overwrite this map or this file and then we can close GIMP and we can start workers and resources Soviet Republic again we load our game and now we will try to build oil rigs again and as you can see 
the dots are green, which means that there's oil on the map. So basically we just uh, put the red color at the places where we want to have oil. I'll just, I, I just spread it all over the map. So that's why we have oil everywhere. And well, we can just build one of them. And then you will see that this one's creating quite a lot tons of oil per day. So you can do the same thing actually with iron and coal. And probably there are even other things that you can edit with um, s with GIMP. Like, I don't know, maybe the other DDS files have something else to offer. If I find something out, of course, I will let you know and I will load another video. Thanks for watching. If you liked the video, leave a like and have fun with the game. It's really a great game. Everyone who didn't buy it yet, buy it. It's really worth it. It's a really cool game. Okay, bye-bye.